Alright, hello everyone and welcome back to Tropico, where today we'll be starting up the Dogs of War mission to build the largest military in the Caribbean. And I, I am looking forward to this as I always do like building militaries in this game. I don't always enjoy the actual fighting because you have little control, but I like the armies nonetheless. Though, for today's episode, I'm... I'm also a little bit apprehensive because we'll be playing on Porta Coco, which doesn't have nearly as developed of an economy as Isla Rojo has. So I'm worried about maintaining said military. I I'm guessing we'll probably have unlimited cash at our disposal thanks to the previous mission where we gathered together a million dollars. Uh, so I'm guessing, like with uh, when we gathered all that gold in the first mission, that we'll get regular payments of like 10 grand or something like that. Uh, that is my guess. We'll have to see how that goes. But uh, yeah, Porto Coco, man. Oh, not as well built of an island as Isla Rojo. But what the heck, let's get going and see how it all turns out for me. Hopefully well. War. War never changes. Indeed it doesn't. The conflict between the tropic and islands seems predestined. Well, we, we did kind of travel back this in time, time to do with that. fight simply to endure the storm. This time, we fight to save not only Tropico, but the whole world. No pressure. If our previous attempts to rewrite history have proven anything, it is that small changes have no effect. They simply uh, correct themselves. Professor Zweistein is certain that Tropico is a focal point for the events about to unfold. Whoever controls Tropico decides the fate of the world. All right. I always suspected it would be that way. No, you didn't. Okay, so, dogs of war. <laughs> Let's... Oh, Has my. heard your orders. We've begun the military preparations for our invasion of Cayo de Fortuna. Excellent! We commence Operation T-Day as soon as all the required troops have joined the invasion force. Soldiers will leave the island and join the invasion force each year automatically. So we will need a steady population in flux of raw recruits to take their places. For the sake of the future, I hope your plan works, President A. Assemble the invasion force, half of our soldiers and tanks will enjoy- oh my god, half of our forces will join the invasion each year. That, um... Wow, we really, we really need to build a good military. Okay, well let's accept and pause. Rotate the camera around to the angle I like to have it at. And, uh... Oh, Constitution. Okay, okay, okay. First off, we need to do constri uh, conscription. Keep with that because since we have to keep Getting more and more soldiers, I, I can't be bothered with educating them. Wealthy citizens vote, I think, will still be a good way to go about things. Oh my god, we have 39% approval. Oh crap! <laughs> maybe, maybe I should make the popular vote of the people and make them happier. Oh, you know what, actually, yeah, all citizens vote, we're gonna do that. That should hopefully make some of the groups happier with things. Uh, secular state, yeah, we'll stick with that as well. What the heck? And let's... Oh, not edicts, I wanted to start getting some research going. Uh, we need to get tanks ASAP, so embassy... Oh, no, uh, not embassy. Constitution options, then embassy, then tanks. Uh, let's see, what should we do after that? We need to get... I would like to build a dry dock on this island so we can get more trade ships around, so steel, dry docks... There we go, I'll do that route, and then we'll move on from there. Oh my, oh my, okay, I, I am I'm worried about this. Invasion progress, zero of a hundred? Oh my god, do we have to get together a hundred soldiers? <laughs> oh, 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 crap. <laughs> this is, this is not gonna go well for me, is it? All right, okay, let's see what this quest is. The world war is raging on. The army needs new facilities. Indeed it does. Remember, all military buildings contribute additional troops to the invasion force each year. Cayo de Fortuna's days are numbered. Okay, and excellent. 40 people will immigrate to the island. We're going to need as many people as possible. So, two new military buildings. We're going to do that right off the bat. Let's see. Military, and let's build ourselves some barracks down here by the docks. I, oh no, you know what? I'm actually going to build it over by this wharf. 
because last time we were here, pirates would invade from over here and over here. So I'm thinking a barracks here, and actually, yeah, a barracks over here should help prevent those invasions, or at least slow them down, hopefully. And that'll take care of those two buildings. Oh my god. Oh, I need to build houses too for my people. Oh, let's just... Let's get a tenement right off the bat to sort of start things up here. We we definitely need it. And a clinic because there is none on this island since we were last here in the colonial era. Our people need medical care. Oh my. <laughs> 35%. Oh god. Okay, fast forward time. Let's roll. Oh, actually, 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 let's go to 1x. All right, our managers are still set from last time we are we were here. That is good. If you think that the communists and the capitalists are a bunch of crazies kind of our stupid ideals, well, wait till you see the other guys. One lot of them walk around everywhere with loaded weapons. Fun. And others, for the most part, refuse to drink alcohol in obscene quantities. How dare they? People, where is our society headed? I don't know, Lulu. I don't know. Oh my, oh, and I definitely don't know where our society is headed with me at the helm. Oh god, we've gone down 9% approval. <laughs> oh my, oh, I am screwed. We do have this gold mine, though, oh god. Hmm, 13,000. What is this one at, 26,000? Yeah, I'm going to have to pay close attention to this one so we don't overburden it and get, uh, well, have it be depleted. That would be very, very bad for us. Oh, trade routes. I should probably check those. Actually, first, what are we growing? Coffee, corn, sugar, sugar, coffee. So, basically, coffee and sugar are our two main industries here. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, we have an export for sugar to the Axis, which we can't do. Oh, lovely. Uh, we aren't doing any iron. Great. Oh, wonderful. The only one we can actually take advantage of is meat. Oh, no, we can't do that either. 70 standing. Oh, my God. <laughs> what do the factions think of us? This is not a good thing to start off with. Oh, 60 and 45. Oh, oh my. Hey, we've gone back up a couple of percentage points on the popular support. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am screwed. It's probably going to be an election that's going to end up killing me in this match, isn't it? That's That would not surprise me in the slightest. Okay. Oh, people need entertainment, healthcare. I'm working on that. And religion. Oh, come on. You have... Oh, yeah. We really did not build any religion, did we? <laughs> okay. Note to self. Let's build them a church. Right there. <laughs> God. Oh, there's so many things I didn't build. I can't believe I didn't even build them a uh, mission. That is, that seems strange that I wouldn't do that. But oh well, mission Mr. here. President, the world has changed. We need to create a dystopian future where everything is bleak. Ah, uh, yes, what? you and that dystopian future again. Oh, why did I go there? I meant... No, I didn't mean edicts either. Research! Steel is way back here. So if we can get two industries going, of which we already have one... That would be good, and my god, I need cash. <laughs> I was really hoping we'd be uh, getting a whole lot of cash influx from that previous mission. But it would not appear that that is the case. Ugh, that worries me. Okay, let's... I'm hoping some more trade routes pop up, man. Pineapples, I'm not doing. Meat, no. Sugar, can't. Iron, don't do it. Yeah, I, I really don't like that I don't have a single trade route to take advantage of right now. That uh, That is worrisome. And we're going into a lot of debt. I may have to take some sovereign debt for this. I hate doing that, but... Seriously, we just put together a million dollars in the previous mission. Why aren't we rolling in that? This next song to my ex oh yes, your ex-boyfriend again. He joined the military, didn't he? Because I quote, they'll treat me better than... They probably really will. They probably will. Trip, Wherever you are now, at least you won't get bitten by an alligator. I'm still wondering what kind of shopping she does where an alligator is a worry. I wondered this in the last mission when we got that exact same radio bit. But, um, yeah, I think Reggie's better off. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. How is money is not doing well at all? Oh, crap. 
11 open jobs, so we definitely need more people. Well, once we get another military base up and going, that should be a good thing. Two Teamsters offices who do need to be fully budgeted up. I definitely need that. Oh, hey! Hey, we're back in the positives. That's wonderful. Now let's waste that money by building some more housing that my people desperately need. All right, I'm not even going to bother with the country houses. Actually, you know what? I'll get a few down because I've got two spaces right there we can fit them in. But other than that, we're going to be going tenements to get just people into houses in general. Let's actually just go ahead and build another right now. Right there. We definitely need it. The people need to be made happier. Oh, good. We're up to 40%. That is a glorious. We... <laughs> We certainly need it, because we'll probably end up with an election in not too long. And as for the industries, what industries... Oh, hey, cool, we got the 40 citizens. Excellent. Uh, textile mill would be good. We'd have to start doing some wool or cotton. I'd really like to get the rum distillery going, because we do have sugar, but that's going to take a lot of money. Uh, money I don't have. Seriously, though, where's that million dollars? It's not, like, in my, uh... Dynasty, is it? No, no, it's not. It's definitely not. Can I upgrade any of these folks? For 40 grand, I can. Hmm. Well, we're on a military mission, so you know what? General, you're getting upped. And... Tycoon, I'll level you up as well. There we go. Oh my, oh my. I'm still... Still annoyed that we haven't had a new dynasty member in ages, but oh well, what are you going to do? Just the luck of the draw, I guess. Okay, we're, we're starting to get in some money now, which is good. I keep wanting to check trade just in case anything changes. <gasps> Coffee! Which I can't do. Oh, God. <laughs> Bauxite, can't do that. Still don't have pineapples or steel. Wow, the trade routes kind of suck this time around. I probably should build another dock, though, just so we can get things out more quickly. And, oh no, those both are set up to their max budget, which is always, always a wonderful thing. Though, actually, economically speaking, we're not doing too horrible right now, which is good. And why is this invasion progress not ticking up? Shouldn't it be with those soldiers? As per hold on, hold on, hold on. Really Assembly of the Invasion Force, the blah, blah, blah. Uh, hmm. I'm wondering how that ticks up then. Do we need tanks? Because if so, I don't have tanks. That's that's still a ways off. Oh my, we need to go and do a little deficit spending. I definitely need to get some more things up and running. People need more entertainment, most likely. Well, let's actually check the almanac. Healthcare. That place hasn't been built yet. Yeah, they're going to need more entertainment too. Oh, the clinic is built just to no know workers. Let's invite one foreign worker, hopefully, in an immigrant pool. We'll get more. But uh, let's see. Yeah, definitely get another restaurant out. I'm going to pop it right here on the corner. Hopefully, it should take care of these tenements, houses, and that tenement there. That, uh, that's my hope. And that church should be good, too. Let's put that on high priority. Don't want the religious crowd hating. Let's see, our military bases are doing good, though. We've got both of those filled with people, I believe. Yep, we do. Excellent. These, though. Now, I don't know if we're going to be getting invaded ourselves. We probably will be, so I'm going to have to upgrade these to machine guns at some point. But at the moment, I've really got to focus on making sure my people don't vote me out of office. Because, well, that would end the mission very, very quickly for us, so yeah, yeah, that's definitely something we need to avoid. I'm going to build this road out a bit. I'll probably build a couple more farms out here so we can get some more exports going. And we've got a lot of stuff in these docks, which is good. Check the trade routes, see if anything new has popped up. I'm going to be checking these constantly for anything good that may pop up, but uh, at the moment... We still got nothing that we can use. It is coffee, right, that we're doing? Yes, it is. Hmm. Yeah, I need another industry. We could definitely use it. A foreign worker has arrived. Hopefully it's a doctor. It was our doctor. And quick save. Okay, okay. So, people should be getting some medical treatment now, which is good. I'm actually going to do the hospitalization wing, even though that's going to take five grand. Hey, 13 soldiers join the invasion. Let's actually go back to that. 
All right, okay, so just half of our soldiers go out. So that's what we, what builds up this. So eventually soldiers will just join up with the invasion. I'm wondering, and I'm guessing once we hit a hundred, that's when we trigger an invasion of, uh, oh, who are we invading? A KO de Fortuna, I believe it was. All right, okay, okay, let's see. I should build some more plantations to get some more stuff going. Let's see, banana, cocoa, no. Coffee, we've already got two coffee plantations. Cotton, this would be good. We could get that textile mill going and that could be our uh, next industry. And it looks like that's the best fit for over here. So let's build one there. And I don't have the money to build a second. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> oh my, oh my. Oh, now we do. Okay, we just got some money there. Always gotta love that. All right. I'll probably also build another ranch down here because I don't know. Actually, that ranch, that cattle ranch, should reach these plantations with its upgrade. It is upgraded, right? It is not. Oh my god, now it is. There we go. What about these? Let's see. Fiber fertilizer increases the effectiveness of other nearby plantations. Yeah, we'll do that, but not, not now. I actually want to wait a bit. I would like to get that industry up. Because what do we get from that? Steel mill technology, which means one less thing we have to research. Oh my god, we aren't researching. <laughs> I completely forgot that at the end of the mission we played on this island last, we ran out of research to do, so I fired everyone in the library to uh, save on money and get them to do other professions. Let's invite a foreign worker. Hopefully that'll trigger in some more people to come. Oh god. God, I can't believe that. I completely spaced out and forgot about that. So we've been doing absolutely nothing on this research. Ah, uh, God. <laughs> a, a very, very poor start to this map, but uh, we can recover. We can indeed recover. Oh, it's just going to be a bit of a pain. Hey, we're up to 44% though. Let's see... Let's do community aid, make sure people are happier. That should be one person in there. We just got him arrived there at the docks, which is good. Okay, I need to stop spending money on things until we can afford that uh, textile mill. Let's see, though. Let's actually check. I think there was a trade route for cotton. Unless I'm imagining things, I'm not, and we can do it. Let's put that on you. Anything else? Oh, we can do planks. We do... Oh, no, we can't do planks. Uh, we don't do jewelry or cigars. Oh, my. Oh, my. You know what, though? There was this one for coal. Ah, uh, no, I don't want to do that. I don't want to waste it on coal. That's only 100 bucks profit. Which... Oh, holy crap. I didn't even notice. This one's only 30... Or 65 profit, rather. Oh, well, it's the only trade route we can actually do at the moment. I mean, we could do this coal mine up here, but, uh, hmm, I don't know about that. I still may pop it, but, oh, well, let's see. How are things going in the Almanac? Entertainment has gone... Actually, has that moved? It should have moved. Oh, no, we didn't build this uh, restaurant yet, because all we had before was this tavern. Does the tavern have upgrades? It does not. Come on, restaurant, you're almost built. There we go, lovely. That should make some people happier. Probably will take a bit, especially once there's actually people working there. Okay, and oh yeah, the only things for upgrades are for uh, touristy stuff. Let's see though, let's see. That actually should be raising that entertainment. It lowered the entertainment. What the crap? We were at nine, now we're at eight. What the hell? <laughs> oh my God. And really, really, the religion was zero and a church only gave them 15? Come on, it's a freaking church. You had nothing before. That should have made you happy as hell. <laughs> Probably a poor choice of words there, but oh well, <laughs> it's uh. What I'm going with, what I'm going with. Oh my, how is actually my economy doing? Let's see, revenue 37,000. So we are gonna be making a profit. We have got 33,000 in construction. 
Uh, but 28 in building budget and 3,700 in other. So we will actually be making a couple thousand profit if we just stop building things, which I really need to do. So we can get the textile mill. And... Hmm. I'm wondering if more soldiers will join the invasion from what we have, or if I really need to build enough bases to have 200 soldiers, because it said half. Half of our force. So let's, let's actually check that. How many does this hold? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So 16 between these two buildings. And then... 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 5, 26, then 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. So we have 34 soldiers, so if half of our military, unless the palace doesn't count. Interesting. Hmm. That might be it on that count. Or maybe the guard towers don't count. Who freaking knows? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, actually, I think we might be able to build that textile... No, we can't yet. A little bit more. Uh, th no, no. The textile mill first. We'll be able to get that quicker than the rum distillery. Though I do also want to build that, because that'll be good to get our sugar being made into rum. I mean, come on. Who doesn't like rum? It's delicious. Alrighty. Let's see. A lot of trucks coming in. Teamsters are doing a good job here. Happy with their work. And not quite yet. We need to get to be at least positive 8,000 to be able to do it. And we've gone down to six. <laughs> ah, crap. And we're down to five. Oh, back up. We're, no, no, and down again. Oh, my. Oh, my. Well, might be a while until we get that, but uh, I'm not seeing as many shacks, which is a good thing. A lot of people have moved into these tenements, which is a very, very good thing means they'll be happier. We still only have one guy in the library. Oh um, my, it just needs college education, right? Oh god, I may have to send in more people, because right now 54 months just to get legalese. Oh my, okay. You know what, in this era we don't have access, oh we do have access to the college, ooh, and the observatory. I don't have a hill to build that on though, that's always the disappointing thing. We don't have raised land to build it on. Though it's also annoying because you get teased with this stuff over here, but you can't connect a road over that, that way. Oh my, oh my. Okay, let's see. Oh, we've gone down to 3,000. Oh, I'm never going to get this textile mill. Oh, hey, Ally sent us some cash. Okay, that's good. Oh, and a quest popped. Two Hello. Our buildings have been blown up, Presidente. Oh no! I am sure saboteurs from Cayo de Fortuna are behind this. Those bastards! Our current police force is clearly unable to identify the perpetrators. We need to tighten the internal security and prevent the saboteur from destroying more buildings. Okay, wait. What building got bombed? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's pause. Let's pause. I'm not seeing a bombed building. Huh. Yeah, yeah, no bomb building. Interesting. Well, ah, uh, crap. I, I really need to build that police station then. If there is a threat of my buildings being bombed, we're, uh, we're going to build a police station. I don't want to do this because i rather spend that money on working towards my industry, but oh well. There is our police station. And I also just realized we've been playing on just the single speed all this time. So... <laughs> Oh my oh my, but on the plus side, more than half the people like us now, which is a good thing. It is a very, very good thing. Alright, police station, let's get that built, so... Yeah, I definitely don't want my buildings being bombed, though again! I'm not actually seeing a bombed building. Which, you know, I'm a not complaining about. Tropican police, who just got a new home. Officer Mendez, you know you can strip search me anytime. Go Officer, Mendez! I forgot your handcuffs. I kept them as a little memento. But if you need them, I could take your hat instead. Okay, so we got enough money to build this textile mill. Let's get that, even though it is the only construction. I'm still going to put it on high priority. Just, you know, it makes me feel better. Our police has caught the bomber from Keo de Fortuna. 
who didn't actually bomb anything. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, they caught him though, so that makes me happy. All right, let's, uh, I would like to get this popped before we end the episode, because we are at the 25 minute mark here, so I'm gonna end it here in a moment. We're actually not doing too bad though. 25 soldiers have now enjoined up for the invasion. That is good. Though I have a feeling this mission isn't going to help out with uh, the changing the timeline either, because in the last timeline, we got invaded by Isla Rojo and Porto Coco, and I kick their butt. So, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I doubt this is going to be useful, but oh well, c'est la vie, that is what we are supposed to be doing. Any new trade routes? Oh yes, I'm doing the cotton one. Uh, logs? Nah, not a great price though. Planks? Man, there really is no good trade on this one. I am lucking out with trade, which is kind of annoying, but... Oh well, what are you gonna do? Ooh, mission. Presidente, I have information that a great war will start soon. Oh, I know! We we're we're kind of trying to start it, so I'll accept. The we need more barracks for this anyway. Oh, hello! It's usual drawing of lots to decide who has to die to kick off the great war. Oh, yes? All right, the winner is Franz Ferdinand. He wasn't thrilled about it. Uh, the bookmakers are taking bets. Who will be the lucky assassin? I say we participate as well. Select a dynasty member uh, who will attempt to murder Franz Ferdinand. Send an assassin. I'm sending Gerardo. I send him to everything. I don't know why, but eh. And there we go. We got another industry Cash going. Flow has increased. My books on psychology say I should offer you Yeah, a but your things suck. So start making <laughs> smarter choices I'm not often. importing either of those, so I'll take the money. I'm a little disappointed in that. No, we did get steel technology, though, which is one less thing we have to research. Ooh, did we get some more researchers? One more. One more researcher. Lovely. That is good. And uh, we're starting to get into the positives. Oh my god, one person at this factory. Oh my, oh my, oh my. But you know what? I'm going to pause the game, and we're actually going to end it here. We're at 27 minutes, and I don't want this to run for too freaking long. So, uh, yeah, we're doing all right so far. We're about a quarter of a way to, I'm guessing, the first of several invasions. And uh, things, things should hopefully go well. Oh, hold on a minute. Oh, that barracks mission popped. We just had to have... Two. I thought it meant that we'd have to uh, build two more. Oh, okay. Well, that was a free mission pop. I didn't even realize that it set off. But okay. Okay. Well, but yeah, I hope you all have enjoyed this episode. And of course, that you come back for the next. But until then, thank you for watching. And as always, have a good one. <laughs>